हाँ हेलो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स माय सब्सक्राइबर्स आई वांट टू टॉक समथिंग ऑन द टॉपिक इट्स नॉट अ टॉपिक इट्स एन इश्यू रेगार्डिंग द सौजन्य केस विच हैड हैपन द ट्वेल्व इयर्स बिफोर इन द धर्मस्थल द केस इज नाउ इज इन द वायरल टुडे बिकॉज ऑफ the court has given a judgment that there is no any evidence against the culprit who has de, uh, declared as a culprit and assigned for the uh, that uh, person to be jailed and now we all the people of karnataka on the observers I'll believe that the person is going to be arrested and going to be punished, and we have the more assumptions and the more expectations now. But now what? The Dharmasthala case now it has become viral because the person who has arrested the name with us uh, Santosh something is okay. Uh, he is. Not a culprit. Mean is not involved. Is not uh, there in the case of uh, Saujanya. And the court has given a clear judgment that there is no proper investigation of a uh, Saujanya who has uh, uh, in the case like a medical officer, like doctor, police. And the inquiry officers, and now it's clearly telling that the the twelve years, the eleven years before, when the Saujanya has been brutally murdered and raped, the swab of the Saujanya has not been really clearly submitted to the laboratory regarding the what had exactly happened to her, and now. There is no evidence for her rape and murder. Then what reason? No. Then who was the rapist? The who was the murder? No. Then what is the case? Why she has raped? As a woman, you have to. As a girl, a woman, the many people are uh, raising their voice against to the injustice. You just think of yourself and I also. If the Sojanya, if she were my sister, if she were your sister, what would be your response? Would you allow to let it be? You couldn't able to fight. Would you allow that? No, no, no. Then what is it? that much of tolerance intolerance we have as a personally or publicly comes the matters even the cbi inc involved that cbi we believed in that is it is an ultimate decision on the inquiry the judgment and its uh, case handling the way even though cbi has declared there is no culprit on culprit on this case then who that's the matter so it is very unrealistic indigestive reluctantly the government of karnataka whether they it may be congress or bjp it is not a matter it is a matter of justice of a woman or a man we are living in a society 
the allegedly what they have given the judgment it is an injustice because that the court only expect the cases on what we are producing for the case proofs documents only so that's how what happening so we need to raise our voice against the injustice this is what i want to do share my thought my opinion on the sojourn case if it is a court is going to be ask only the proofs and evidence means then what about there is no proofs or evidence means then the girl 17 year old girl happened 11 year before so neck and brutally brutally killed and murdered and raped now is the court and declared no one person involved in the turn then who is the culprit who is the real culprit this a matter here if you have a real citizen if you have a common sense if you really respond response to the issues the social contact please to respond okay let's raise against the injustice of such in a case what we are the people believing in that dharma sthala the punya kshetra is so there happened the matter here remove and come here with the gender bias caste bias religion bias okay then only it will be good and we can have a justice okay